you need to take a day off. And true to my word, I actually did. I went on a trip to Poland for a couple of days. I went for a wedding and some photo stuff. But honestly, it's the best thing I've ever done. And that sounds really weird because, you know, you're traveling, you arrive late, and like, what am I doing? What am I doing? Well, do you know what? I'm looking after my mental health. That's what I was doing. Okay, so I'm aware of the privilege it is that I could get on a plane and disappear financially and just time-wise, but looking after your mental health is so important when you are employed in the creative industry. You need to take a day off. You want to know why? Because it's really important for you. Take a day off, go off. Take your camera by all means, but take a day off. Being a boss, take a day off. Why? It's really f***ing important, believe me. Burnout, we is not for everybody, and it should not be for you. Now you're going to tell me, oh, but I've got bills to pay. You're right, you do have bills to pay, which is why you need to be pricing your work accordingly. And if you're not pricing your work accordingly, and you don't know your outgoings, that's one of your big reasons why you haven't burned out, because you're overworking to get the bills in. You need to not spend so much time going on how to do perfect lighting on it. It's actually what you need to do. Learn about marketing, learn about what sells, and send your client more than you need to know about lighting. Lighting's still important if you're a photographer, after all. As you can see here, this is the worst lighting for me. We are actually going to talk about taking time to learn about how to run a business. Because once you know how to run a business, you aren't going to spend hours working for little pay. You're going to have respect for yourself and your time and understand that if you're working way too hard, you're going to burn out way too quick. No, I know not everyone can get away, but you can find time for six more months like I am watching the YouTube here. Honestly, take time out for yourself be it in travel, be it just enjoying the moment. I went off exploring in Poland once I'd done all the other jobs. I enjoyed going to the wedding because my mental health is absolutely paramount when it comes to looking after myself and fundamentally looking after my business. So much about being a photographer is you using your camera as a tool and, so, and it's so easy to fall out of love with it. And I found myself constantly feeling like I was just using it to make money. And while that is an amazing thing to do, you sometimes fall out of love and you end up in a stagnated state. And mentally it was not good for me. So I take these times out to reconnect with what it is that I love about photography. And none of these images are absolutely stellar, but you know what? I had the best time I was out there. No aim, just take pictures of things that made me laugh, I liked. And I got to hang out with the most incredible people who literally just wanted to hang out with me and we had the best time visiting these places around Poland and just feeling like you were enjoying the moment. Yes, I had the camera with me, but I was literally capturing what I liked and wanted to remember. I felt like a true tourist. And yes, there is a privilege with that, of which I am acutely aware. But if you do not take time out, if you do not take that day off, if you do not go out and live in that moment and have that party, I can guarantee your mental health will suffer 100% and you will not be able to do this for as long as you want and you will have burnout. Believe me, because I know, because I was on the cusp of it and I managed to bring myself back. So get out there, bloody enjoy life again, please. Lots of this YouTube is all about earning money and doing this, but very few are talking about our mental health, which is so, so important.